There are many health conditions and diseases that necessitate a patient spending time in the intensive care unit, or ICU for short. Often the ICU can be a stressful and worrisome time for patients and loved ones, so I want to share with you some of the background information on our facility and what this means to you or your loved one should someone you know get admitted to our neuro ICU. Mayo Clinic was the first hospital to open a neuro ICU in the Northeast Florida region and one with a board certified neurointensivist, which would be me. Um, I had the pleasure of joining the Mayo team in 2006 as the region's first subspecialty trained neurointensivist, and the following year in 2007, we started our multidisciplinary unit. Today, Mayo Neuro ICU has a staff that works around the clock 24 7 to care for these patients. A Neuro ICU is a subspecialty unit that cares for the sickest brain and spinal cord injury patients and other types of neurological patients that require ICU level care. Our dedicated multidisciplinary team includes physicians from neurology, neurosurgery, critical care, anesthesia, pulmonary subspecialties, as well as subspecialty nurses, nurse practitioners, pharmacists, case managers, and a dedicated ICU rehab team comprised of physical, occupational therapists, and speech pathologists. We deliver specialized care for the most common and devastating stroke patients, such as brain aneurysms, tumor, spine patients, and even rare neurological patients who end up in the ICU. One of the things that sets the NeurICU apart is that the Mayo NeurICU is most technologically advanced from robotic technology and telepresence to advanced brain monitoring techniques such as EEG, non-invasive brain oxygen monitoring, intracranial pressure, and we're the only region that has multimodal monitoring technology. Our skills and services mean that we have a considerable experience and outstanding outcomes for our patients compared to national benchmarks. And to give you an idea of that, we have the lowest rates of ventilator-associated pneumonia, central line-associated bloodstream infection, and our mortality uh, for national quality benchmarks are among the best in the nation. We've also been recognized by the National Patient Safety Group, LeapFrog, and ranked number one hospital in the U.S. News and World Report ratings for our city.